It's a fucking beautiful day today. I think we're gonna go outside for once. Does that sound like an idea? That sounds like an idea, dude. You came up with an idea. Let's do it. Later. Back, back from the dead. Radar here, Steve Bot here. <laughs> it's a little windy outside, but we're gonna go drop off some packages for my precise pack. Paying customers first. I just sent uh, some personalized messages to some key journalists out there, hoping that they'll be interested in covering our story. The way I did it was finding similar projects that they already covered in the past and then targeting those journalists to make sure that they already write on those types of topics. It's not salvageable. Everything around us is crumbling. <laughs> God damn it, I'll save it. Oh, uh, we need to be productive, but how? How with no internet? It's 4 p.m., checking in. Gonna check out our board, see what we've accomplished so far. All right, so Steven, you got the people who love us graphic done, right? <laughs> as well as the timeline production. I'm uploading now. All right, both uploaded and complete. I have found the five key blogs and I've emailed them. Uh, kick boosters. We got to look into this to set up our affiliate program. And then we got to do uh, search for uh, meetups that we can go to. So we'll do that later. We haven't gotten any new backers today. And to be honest, it feels like nobody likes us. That's true. How do we f how do we fight this negative energy, man? I prefer the stress seat. We just keep moving forward. We thought of new strategies to shoot at. Uh, we're gonna keep working on them. That's all we can do. We think about what kind of product. Watching how to get funded on Kickstarter videos. Kind of Eating the world's <laughs> hottest <laughs> wing, apparently. It's so it's so hot. That's terrible. <laughs> It just got rejected by Fast Company. At least someone responded to us. So, we just got another backer. One. Feels great. Uno. You gotta count them all. Dude, so exactly. stoked. Thank you, Javier. You're the man. I know you don't know me and I don't know you, but you are the man. There's a lot of stuff going on. Like, people got problems. Just deal with it and move on. Keep moving forward until they put you in jail or take all of your stuff. <laughs> Keep moving forward. Even then, don't stop. You can create a Kickstarter as a homeless guy, and I guarantee you'll get funded. <laughs> what are you talking about? I have two questions. I'll start with one. <laughs> What's the biggest piece of advice you'd give yourself if you were starting over from scratch? If I was starting over, make sure, this might be only online business, Make sure you have a large margin to actually acquire customers. That way you can actually scale. And then I would definitely say, don't do it on your own. Just get a partner beforehand. So my second question would be, when you first started, I know things were probably not easy to get your first sale. How did you keep yourself motivated without making any sales? How did I? How did you keep yourself motivated? Biggest thing is, I know I want this lifestyle. This is what I want. Like, I don't want to do anything else. I just want to be an entrepreneur. One, I want to make my parents proud. I want to... No. Oh. Two, I want to make money someday. Eventually. Three... What is three? It, does there have to be three? <laughs> yeah. Three? I just really want it really bad. So I just read a very interesting article on startup PR. Uh, I think that would have helped before I sent out those emails to top five blogs today and media companies got rejected by Fast Company. Right. But one rejection does not necessarily mean no. I can nurture this relationship and turn it into a, an article about Buffer later on. That's my mindset. No doesn't always mean no. No means no for now. And then you become a fast company is when they'll write about it. Exactly. You. And I hope they see this video. <laughs>
<laughs> but anyways, it's fucking 10 p.m. We've been in here since 10 a.m. Let's go get some shut eye, you know, rest up, recharge. We're back at it again. High five me. <laughs>